Let's go. It is finally time for the weekend to start. It is Friday right now and I just got released for the day. Fridays we do open air beds. So whenever we wake up in the morning, we have to take all of the sheets off of our beds, fold them up like this, go to school. Our room is still clean and inspection order. Then when we come back from school, we have PT on Fridays. So you see my PT gear sitting right over here because I have already changed out of my PT gear. And once PT is done, you are released for the weekend and you can enjoy your time to yourself. Now, there is still curfew that you have to abide by, but if you have a 4392, then you can stay out past curfew on the days that you are authorized to take a 4392. 4392 is a travel request form that you fill out and submit to your MTL for approval. This allows you to go past the normal radius that you're allowed to go, or it allows you to stay overnight on the weekend. On the weekends, no one is coming in to inspect your rooms, at least until Monday when I leave for school, have my room in inspection order by then during the duty day. Hello. Sandbox is a veteran owned company that helps keep your loved ones connected from recruitment to retirement. I personally use Sandbox when I was at BMT and it was so helpful because your friends and family can send a letter from anywhere with their mobile app. I received a letter literally two days after it was written which is crazy. So Sandbox does make receiving mail at military training a lot faster and they have so much more information to help your loved ones navigate your military career. So be sure to check them out at sandbox.us. So my husband just flew in and you literally just got here right before I parked. This is the hotel we are staying at. We just filmed an Instagram reel. Now this one that we just filmed is going on our Got Love Instagram. And we are also watching the Golden Knights game. That's why I'm repping the jersey today. We're also gonna be stationed back in Vegas, which we are super excited about. And the game is on tonight. And he is here with me, so we get to watch it together. We're gonna sit and eat inside, but it is closed off to the dining. I hope it's good. It's so heavy. It's like a mess, but it's fun. Just kind of making things work sometimes. I don't know if that's the best idea. Yeah. Next stop, Dave and Buster's, and I completely miss you doing that. <laughs> don't, don't get hurt. And when you get the 50 ticket bonus. Oh! I got it! I got the triple! So both of us ended up getting the triples, and we were able to complete two full sets. Come and win. Come and win. <laughs> My husband made a really <laughs> quick trip in, so you were only here for like 24, 24 hours. hours. Yeah. I have not had any coffee today, so I'm stopping at PJ's Coffee. I really like this place, but there is none near base. It was about 30 minutes away, so kind of in between. So I figured I would stop here on my way back and grab some coffee and finish the rest of the 30 minute trip. Well, it is currently 6.30. Does anyone else ever do that where you just like sit in your car forever? I didn't do a ton with the rest of my evening, but now I need to make my bed. This is my roommate. Hi, what did you do this weekend? Played some cards with friends in the day room, watched a movie in the day room, and got some food. And when did you get your hair done? I did get my hair done this weekend too. And it looks great. Thank you so much. Yeah. Not even eight o'clock yet. I'm already in bed and I'm just gonna hang out and relax. So today's Sunday and I have no obligations this morning. So I slept in, it's like 10 o'clock right now. So I'm finally gonna get up. Finally made my way out of the dorms today, checking out things in the local area. And I have a few minutes until formation. So I'm gonna go ahead and put my laundry in the washer. And then as the weekend comes to an end, I just get my uniform ready for the next day. That way, when I wake up in the morning, have all my stuff and I'm good to go. So this was a little bit of a different style video, just showing you what a weekend at tech school is like for me. Every single weekend is completely different. Sometimes I'll fill out a 4392 so I can travel further or so I can stay overnight. Friends and family can come visit you. Some weekends I don't go anywhere and I just sleep in and I hang around in the dorms because I just wanna relax from the week at school and I just don't wanna go out and do anything. I've traveled to places around the area. I've gone to DC, I've gone to Annapolis, I've gone to Baltimore. So while you're at tech school, definitely take advantage on visiting the places around you because once you get stationed somewhere, you're probably not gonna be back in this area anytime soon. So as you can see, weekends at tech school are literally just like normal weekends. You can essentially go out and do whatever you want but of course there are rules that you have to follow so you don't have to fill out a 4392 that just allows you to travel further than your normal radius or stay overnight you can still go do whatever you want you just have to be back for curfew each night so after friday formation once you're released you can go hang out with friends go to the mall go out to eat you just have to be back for curfew on friday saturday morning wake up go to whatever you want you have to be back for curfew and then on sunday wake up go to whatever you want you have to be back for evening accountability before the week starts and of course make sure you are making 
making the right decisions and you are being smart about the people that you hang out with. There are a lot of alcohol related incidents that happen at tech school, unfortunately. So make sure you are not being part of those situations. Stop it. Get some help. Stop it. Get some help. Stop it. Stop it. But have fun at tech school. Use the weekend to relax, make memories, go explore and adventure because weekends at tech school are just like normal weekends.